We really wanted to investigate Montalvo as a place and use that as a way to kind of launch a series of aesthetic inquiries and then questions that organically emerged from our observations. Thinking about investigating the intersections of social and natural ecologies, the Lucas Artist Residency Program and the kind of estate of Montalvo was a perfect place to really begin that work because it has both this incredibly expansive natural realm, as well as it's very well used by the local community. So another part of our work is actually creating platforms for social interaction and engagement. We actually have been playing off of the name of our group called Fieldworks Collaborative, and we've designed a series of field stations that we've enacted and enlivened in the Montalvo grounds. We began just playing in the landscape and looking around for things that attracted our attention and we started collecting objects like pine cones and branches. So we came back and we played with them in our studio. It was just a way for us to kind of understand the layers of the landscape. One of the things that we've used our residency here for is to create a laboratory. During our time here, we've just kind of collected, brought stuff in, tried to think about what are the connections we're making. We're, in, we're really interested in the tradition of the Wonder Commons, and there's a lot of things around kind of scientific practice, data collection, and collecting and examining that has really influenced our thinking. So we developed this color field station, which is basically going to be a large wooden wall with pegs on it. And we're going to be having people engage in finding things in the landscape that they want to match the color to and making little painted tags of those colors they find, which will go on the wall. So we're trying to kind of document what the landscape of Montauville looks like you know, on this day in fall of 2015. And we're hoping that they'll begin to map the changes in color that they see in the landscape from September through early December. The Lucas Artist Residency is really a gift for artists. It's amazing to have the time and space to really think about things that you have nagging at the back of your mind. When we're in our kind of regular lives and our work lives with our families and our jobs and everything else, it's sometimes hard to really have that isolated space to really develop an idea. You know, you're really well cared for here too. And it's, it's nice to come into a space of work where you're in a development stage and everything is sort of taken care of for you so you can just really focus on your thinking. And for Trina and I, we were at the beginning of establishing Fieldworks Collaborative. And so it gave us an opportunity to really figure out what we wanted to do together and to, you know, begin our conversations about what that might be. When we first got here and we started wandering the trails, we just started to pick up things because one of the things that happened was we've been working in the kind of conceptual art realm for so long. It kind of brought me back to my, you know, art roots. And so now we're trying to take that process we've we've kind of rediscovered and bring it back into the realm of the conceptual because that's sort of where our heads are now. 